guys, it's Elena and today I have another cloth diaper video for you. Today I'm going to be reviewing three different items from Barely and I do want to let you know that they did send me these items to review for you guys to tell you all about them. I'm not being paid to tell you that they're awesome or anything. All of my opinions are always 100% my own and honest, but I do want to let you know that they sent them to me. I did not buy them with my own money, just FYI. So anyway, I'm going to be reviewing their Terry Flat their bamboo cotton flat and a cover. So let's hop right in. All right, so first of all, let's talk about their bamboo cotton flat. If you've watched any of my videos in the past, you know that I love flats. I love me some flats. They are my favorite type of absorbency type of insert to put inside of a diaper. So you can take a flat and you could just fold it up into a little rectangle, into a little pad, and then you can lay that inside of a cover and use it just like that. You can also stuff it into a pocket diaper to use as the absorbency. They are affordable, they are absorbent, they are so versatile, they clean well in the washer, they dry well quickly in the dryer. Flats are just the best, if you ask me. Um, but you can also use a flat like old school, you know, you can actually take a flat, fold it up into like an old school little diaper shape and wrap it around baby. You can pin it on, you can snappy it on, you can take a flat and actually wrap it around on baby and make it secure around baby before you go and put a cover on top to make it waterproof. So flats are great. You can use them from tiny babies to bigger toddler sized kiddos. They're just the best. So these ones in particular from Barely, when I did my absorbency test on them. So I just take the flat, I uh, fill, fold it up into the little rectangle shape that I would be using it in as an insert. I lay that on my counter and I pour water on top until it starts to pool over the edges and is not absorbing the water anymore. And I got over a cup and a half of absorbency, which is wonderful. That's great. So yeah, a cup and a half is wonderful. My favorite inserts are a cup and a half to a cup and three quarters. My like bare minimum kind of absorbency is a cup and a quarter. So seeing over a cup and a half is great. That's a wonderful absorbency. If you have a kiddo who is a heavy, not like heavy water, you have a kiddo who is an average wetter, maybe kind of toward a heavy wetter, a cup and a half is a great amount of absorbency if you ask me. Um, yeah, some people do have to boost even with an absorbency that high, um, but personally, my first kiddo was a heavy wetter and a cup and a half was great for him. And my current baby, Barrett, he is kind of starting to be a heavy wetter and a cup and a half is great for him. So if you have an average wetter or maybe someone who's like kind of borderline heavy, I think that a cup and a half is a perfect amount of absorbency. So anyway, perfect absorbency. Oh, the other thing I really like about this is that it is a bamboo and cotton blend, but it doesn't shrink crazy. Like I've owned this for at least a couple of months. I've owned this for a long time and it doesn't shrink weird. Like you can tell the edges are still nice and straight. They're not like all wavy and like doesn't lay flat. I mean, everything looks great. It has worn wonderfully. I wash it, you know, two, three times a week and it has been wonderful, not shrinking up weird. Sometimes bamboo can shrink up a lot and I haven't found that to be an issue with this guy at all. You can buy these in five or 10 packs. I believe they were like four something a piece, which I think is a reasonable price for a nice soft bamboo flat. They are very soft and very nice feeling. Bamboo is a very soft, very luxurious feeling fabric. <laughs> So I do really love these. I would totally recommend them. They are 55% bamboo, 45% cotton, and they're great. Totally, totally recommend these flats, absolutely. Next item I wanna talk about is their Terry flat, and I have the smaller size of this, so um, I don't know what it's like to have the bigger size, but I do wanna say right off the bat, the absorbency in this guy is crazy. So it's a Terry material, so it looks like a towel, and this kind of flat is very popular in like Europe and like the UK and stuff. So these are designed in Ireland actually. And it's just like over there, you know, that part of the world, <laughs> Terry for diapers is much more popular than it is here in America, at least as far as I know. 
So this has a crazy absorbency. When I did the absorbency test on this guy, it got over two cups of absorbency. So usually um, I would call anything with over two cups of absorbency totally nighttime appropriate. It will hold, at least for my three kiddos, <laughs> two cups of, absor of absorbency has been really great for overnight for my kiddos. So if you're looking for an overnight diaper, this would be a really nice option. Now the only kind of downside I have to say about this guy is it's kind of like an awkward size and I know this is the smaller size and Bear is now over a year old and so it's kind of just like an awkward size on him. I'm really like I've looked up videos, I've tried many different ways to fold it to actually wrap it around him and I just can't find a wrap that I really like. I find it to be bulky you know because it is like a nice thick towel like material and so it looks a little bit bulky on him it looks bulky with a cover on top um, the legs always look really like I would be uncomfortable wearing it wrapped around the waist you know um, and then when I go to actually uh, fold it up into just a little um, absorbent pad I find that it's like super thick like it's very very bulky so I haven't figured out a way to really use this Terry flat that makes me super happy um, I guess I just have to kind of use it some more I, you know I've been using these guys for a couple months now and I just haven't figured out how to love this Terry flat um, but it's super absorbent I don't know I just I'm really on the fence about this guy I don't really like it. I don't like it pad folded because it's really thick and I don't really like it actually wrapped around baby either because I find it kind of thick in like the leg area. So I am not a big fan of this Terry flat, but like I said, I love, I love the bamboo flat. It's wonderful. Here I'm going to show you guys how I like to fold up this terry flat. So um, I kind of do it a little bit different every time, but let me kind of show you. I'm folding up the bottom, like maybe about a third of the way up, and then I'm folding one side in and out, and then I kind of like double this, like I bring it over and over and then fold out that back too. And it looks like I made it a little bit too high down here, so let me fold it down a little bit so it's like a quarter. And then fold in and out, and then like double up and out. And then I kind of move this so that it's a little less wrinkly back here. And then just fold it down to make a nice like flat back here and then uh, you can put baby in there and fold it up and use these for the little wings. It is a little crookedy, you know, it's not exactly like this wing's definitely bigger than this one, but that's just the way that I have found kind of works for Barrett at this age. Anyway, let's hop in and talk about the cover. So they call it their outer. This is what goes on top of any kind of fluffy absorbency you have on the inside of the diaper. So the cool thing about Barely is that they make their waterproof material out of 100% post-consumer recycled plastic water bottles, which is just like super duper crazy. It's like really exciting if you ask me. It just makes, it makes you feel so much less like guilty about buying new diapers when you know that it's like made of recycled material because people who are using cloth diapers are already like you know kind of you know eco-conscious thinking about the environment and knowing that it's made out of recycled stuff just makes you feel so much happier so that's a great great little point a little bit of information for you guys that makes me super happy so anyway let's get in and I will show you the breakdown on this guy what it looks like what its features are and I'll tell you how I feel about it so on the front here you can see we have four rise settings so you can fold it all the way down here to make it small for a little kiddo or you can fold it all the way out for a bigger toddler size kiddo you do have one little snap here in the middle you can see 
on the inside it's an actual snap right there so if you have some snap in inserts you can snap it right in there this also tells you where the middle of the diaper is so when you're wrapping it around baby and you have like this side done and then you bring this side over you can see if you're centered on baby because you have that little fancy little button right there in the middle I like to see that that's just something a little little detail that I kind of like so you can see we have elastic here on the front, which is nice to give a great little fit on baby, kind of lower down below their belly button, and just, you know, it's going to give a nice movement and fit around baby's belly area. For the snaps on the wings, you can see we have vertical snaps as well as a hip snap and then on the other side here you can see we have crossover snaps as well which i love crossover snaps because if you have a poopy situation when you're out out of the house you can roll up your diaper snap it shut like that and you have a nice little contained poo mess that you can deal with when you get home throw it in a wet bag inside the diaper bag and deal with it later <laughs> On the back side here, you can see we have some elastic on the back as well. We have nice double leg gussets. I used to really be a stickler, like I'm only going to buy a cover with double leg gussets. So I used to really, really love these. Um, it just kind of gives you a little bit of peace of mind. It kind of creates extra room in here. So if there's like a big blowout situation, like a big poo situation, it's going to help give some space for that poo to expand inside the diaper without escaping from the diaper so that's really nice you can see we have a big generous tummy panel here so this is the belly side of the diaper if you have an insert you can tuck it inside of here and if baby is a belly sleeper or a belly you know belly napper or if baby is wearing kind of like tight pants around their waist this tummy panel here is going to prevent any wetness from inside seeping out into the outside i love a great generous tummy panel like look at that it's great and they're also kind of like kind of flimsy like uh, very generously sized and also just um, I don't know how to describe it like it's just the way it's cut it gives you extra movement here so if there's like a big poo situation and you need to spray everything out it's not gonna get like caught down in here you have it flips out really well and flips out really well on the back side as well you can see it's nice and wide and I don't know how to call it like flimsy or just like open like you just have lots of space here so if there's a poo situation um, it's not gonna get like caught in these little you know flaps on the back and the front of the diaper so barely labels their diapers to fit from 10 to 40 pounds which I really like the honesty in that instead of saying like oh it's gonna fit from newborn they're being honest they're saying it's not gonna fit till baby's like 10 pounds which I agree and I don't I haven't tried it on my middle baby and I don't know if he would really even let me try it on him I'm not sure how big he is right now um, my four-year-old but I believe that this would fit a 40 pound kiddo I think that it is generously sized enough that the 10 to 40 pound um, like range that they give I think that's very accurate I think that this was this would totally fit a bigger kiddo as well so if your kiddos are just big kids or they potty train a little bit later um, I think that these are a really generously sized diaper and they work well so yeah overall these are all reasonably priced diaper items they're like $15.95 on the cover I think these were like four something a piece on both of these so yeah I think they're all reasonably priced items they work well together as a system if you like Terry <laughs> I'm sure you could figure out how to use a Terry flat a little bit better than me but um, flats and covers this used to be my number one go-to diapering system these days I like flats and pockets but I mean it's not that big of a difference right so I would totally recommend the covers I would totally recommend the bamboo flats and if you like Terry <laughs> if you like Terry flats and you know how to use them I mean I'd recommend these too if you know what you're doing with them I just feel like I have not had enough experience with them to really learn what the what the, the appeal is about Terry flats so anyway like I said bear Barely did send me these items I do have other barely reviews that I will leave linked down below as well I would recommend some of these items if you guys see a print or a solid that you like I would totally recommend the covers they recently just came out with or at least it was least it was on pre-order for some beautiful new solids from barely and they're like kind of like more muted kind of colors beautiful colors I would totally recommend to check them out so I will leave a link down below to their site if you are interested if you see something pretty I would totally recommend picking it up. 
So yeah, that's it for today's video. I feel like it was super rambly. I hope that you learned something. I hope it kind of helped you figure out if you wanted to give them a try or not. Give this video a thumbs up if you did like it. Let me know if you have tried any of these Barely products. Let me know if you like Terry Flats. Tell me your thoughts about Terry Flats down in the comments below, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!